Hi, this is Pastor Brian. I'm actually not in Chico. I'm in San Francisco at San Francisco International Airport. Uh, I was planning on being with you uh, this morning and I was excited for that, but a uh, last minute opportunity presented itself for me to be uh, with my parents in Colorado uh, to help them with some arrangements at the house. Uh, please keep them in prayer. Uh, both of them are dealing with health issues and so I just want to be of help to them uh, this week uh, with my brother. Um, I think it's really fitting though that I'm sharing with you from an airport uh, here at this location, uh, people are gathering uh, to be sent to different parts of the world. Uh, some are being sent for business, uh, others for leisure, uh, just a myriad of different missions that people are on, but they all gather here for one purpose, and that's to be sent. Uh, I believe that's the way the church should be, uh, that we should be a people that gather together for the sake of being sent on mission in the world. Uh, that's the whole command of Christ in Matthew 28, is to go into all the world and make disciples, uh, baptizing people in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and then teaching them to obey everything that Christ has commanded, and Christ said that he'd be with us to the very end of the age. And the way he does that is through the Holy Spirit that he gave us the counselor, the comforter, the, the one in us who is God's power and strength abides in us. And so that Holy Spirit empowers us to be gospel people, to go and to bring good news. And so as you guys begin this series in Gospel Fluency, I'm praying that it would help you become the disciple makers that God has called you to be. That you would just not gather and grow in knowledge, but you would actually grow in faith and that God would expand your heart and your vision to be willing to go and make disciples and bring the gospel to the ends of the earth. Look forward to joining you next week. Uh, for now, just enjoy this teaching by Jeff Vanderstelt.